What's up guys, Shane Starnes here with Droid Modern X. A few years ago, we did a video on the Kingo Root application for the PC. They have finally come out with a Kingo Root application for your phone, and it will root just about any Android device. It's simple, quick, and easy, and it requires no computer. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is navigate to the kingoapp.com website. I'll be sure to include a link in the description and then download it for Android. Once you have the application downloaded, you're gonna go into your settings, go into security, and make sure that unknown sources is checked. Then you can go ahead and install the application. Pay close attention to the permissions that are needed. There's a lot of really shady permissions that are needed in this application, which is why as soon as you're done rooting, you're gonna to want to download an application called Super Sumi. I'll be sure to include a link in the description. Uh, that application will remove everything that has to do with Kingo Root and install Super SU in its place. So we're essentially just using Kingo Root to root your device and then once it's rooted, we will remove it completely and install Super SU. As you guys can see, it says that it, it can make phone calls, it can record audio or take pictures and video. It has pretty much every single permission that could possibly be necessary. Kingo Root has said that this app is in no way malicious that they have to have the permissions in order to uh, utilize the exploits in order to get root on various devices. I've used this in the past and as long as you take it off your phone as soon as you're finished with it, I've not had any kind of issues at all. So just keep in mind that you don't want to keep it on your phone, you just want to use it to root and then you'll use Super Sumi to get Super Issue on your device. So we'll go ahead and install. Once it's installed, we'll go ahead and open the application. And this is a simple one-click root, so just click on the one-click root, it's going to go through the process and root the device. Now it may take up to 15 minutes to complete the process, so if it gets stuck somewhere, just kind of walk away and come back to it. Once it's finished, you'll get the message root succeeded. Okay, we'll open up root checker just to check, verify that it is indeed rooted. Verifying root. Okay, here you get your super user request. We'll go ahead and allow it. Our device is now officially rooted. As you can see, it says congratulations, root access is properly installed on this device. So the application I was talking about is called Super Sumi, and you'll want to grab that as soon as you finish your King Root. Okay, it's $3.99. Once it's finished installing, we'll go ahead and open up the application. And all you gotta do here is press the big blue button to begin. Stage one complete, after stage two is finished, if there are Kingo Root icons remaining, simply drag them to the uninstall. Just press the button again to initiate stage two. And as you can see, we have super user now. And we will go ahead and grant super user. So it is, right now it's going through and killing Kingo Root. The Super Sumi also works on King Root and any of the other Root applications. So now we're just installing the updated binaries for Super SU. Once the updated binaries have been installed, you can reboot the device and you are finished. Your phone is now rooted. You have Super SU instead of the shady Kingo root. All right guys, that about wraps it up for this video. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed, I'll see you in the next one.